Okay, they want to present it. Is that a good, powerful word? And that word is coming out of Ecclesiastes chapter 7 and verse 8 and 9. And it says right here, 8, better is the end of a thing than the beginning thereof. And the patient in the spirit is better than proud in spirit. Let us understand one of the fruits of the spirit is to be patient. Like it says in here, it's better to be patient in the spirit than to be proud in the spirit. This is powerful right here. Number nine, be not hasty in the spirit to be angry, for anger resteth in the bosom of fools. Hey Amen. It's a powerful word right here, saints. Let us understand how to rule our spirit. Let us not be quick to be angry, as we see that is for fools. Let us let us be, you know, you know, quick to 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 you know to allow ourselves to assess situations, you know, before you know we allow ourselves just to just dive into it head first and get upset and angry. Let us rule our spirit and understand and discern what the enemy is trying to trick us into. This is a powerful word right here. Let's read it again. Be not hasty in the spirit to be angry, for anger rests in the bosom of fools. Understand, we need to rule our spirit as saints. We need to understand that a whole lot of things in the world is going to cause us to be angry, but assess what you're being angry about. Assess what the enemy is trying to do to deceive you in your spirit. Hallelujah. Praise Jesus. It's a beautiful word right here. Amen.